father sitting at home just reading the newspaper. This little girl comes running in. She's only six. Hello, darling. Hello, daddy. You've been playing? Yeah. In the park? Yeah. With your friends? Well, until the man came along. Till the man came along? Yeah, a man came along and he asked my friends to leave, so it was just me and him. Darling, come, come over. Whatever happened, none of it was your fault, okay, darling? None of it was your fault. But tell Daddy every detail. What happened? Um, he took me behind a tree so no one could see what you're we doing. Oh, God, darling, and then what happened? Um, he took my dress off. Oh, God, what happened next? What happened? Um, he took his thing out. Oh, God, darling, and then what happened? Nothing, that was it. Oh, well, make something up. So this is Jesus here, right? He's a little tiny Arab Jew. <laughs> he looks like Super Mario. <laughs> now, if Jesus is this big, that means his cross was maybe, maybe that big. <laughs> now, I'm not saying I'm better than Jesus. But if I was on that little cross, my feet would be on the ground and I'd fucking live. <laughs> so what killed Jesus can not kill me, I am way more powerful. <laughs> not only would I live, but I would lift the cross out of the ground and beat up all the little Roman bastards. I mean, here's one. Be careful how much you drink. Remember, alcohol loosens inhibitions. So you may end up doing something you regret or worse. Oh, I'm, I'm sorry. Do I regret getting drunk and digging up the corpse of Anne Frank and fucking it on the steps of her house? <laughs> no. <laughs> I thought it was pretty cool. <laughs> now, don't be upset by this information. If you're indeed a dumb cunt with your dumb cunt spouse, your dumb cunt kids, your dumb cunt family, with your dumb cunt friends. Because society's very accommodating to dumb cunts. In fact, there are places where you and your dumb cunt family can go once a week and meet other dumb cunt families. And you can sing songs. And it's called the church. And they've never turned away a group of dumb cunts. The church loves dumb cunts. Doesn't like the smart, what with their constant questions. Smart are always asking questions, and that's like fucking cancer to religion. I was raised Catholic. The thing that used to annoy me about church when I was little was all the standing up and sitting down and kneeling. I wish the priest could just pick a position and fuck me. <laughs> Any other problems? Who else has got a problem? You know, that sounds... I can say that, by the way, because I used to go out with a guy who was half black who totally broke up with me because I'm a fucking loser. And, um... <laughs> I just heard myself say that. So, I'm such a pessimist. I'm the worst attitude. He's half white. And he totally <laughs> broke up with me. I would love to be gay. I'll tell you why, because I'm a man's man. I like men. Men like me, we like each other. I hate women. <laughs> women hate me. We hate each other. The only reason I couldn't be gay is because I could never fuck a man. Because I could never fuck something that I respect. It's so selfish. I don't know what it is, but I know it's bad. I know I'm hurting somebody somewhere. There's something wrong with it. Like, I was thinking the other day that you can figure out how bad a person you are by how soon after September 11th you masturbated, like how long you waited. <laughs> and for me, it was between the two buildings going down. So I have a feeling that... <laughs> I had to do it. I had to. Otherwise, they win. That's the way I was looking at it at the time. It was a strange time.